Ohm's law. This law states that the current flowing through a conductor is directly proportional to the potential difference applied across its ends, provided the physical conditions remains constant. If V is the potential difference and I is the current flowing through an ohmic conductor, then I is directly proportional to V, which follows that I equals constant V. I equals 1 R V here constant is 1 R, R is resistance of the conductor. V equals I R, this is the mathematical form of Ohm's law. We draw circuit diagram of Ohm's law at Ohm's law helps to determine different aspects of a circuit, including the amount of current flowing through the circuit, the voltage and potential difference present between the two given points, and the resistance present in it. We can use this information to be applicable in many daily life activities. We show how Ohm's law works. We take a wire and link it in series with a battery with a range of voltages, a switch, and an ammeter. As we turn on, as you can see, current begins to flow through the conductor. The current is 1.01 ampere at 5 volt. and 2.02 ampere at 10 volts. Similar to how voltage increases at various values, current increases at the same ratios as you can see. Let's graph the data that was seen. We collect each voltage and current value. We plot the data with the voltage along the x-axis and the currents along the y-axis. When we connect all the points, the result is a straight line. The VI graph for ohmic materials is, as you can see, a straight line. The product of I and R equals voltage now that V equals I R, according to Ohm's law. If we increase the voltage while maintaining a constant value for either I or R, the other value increases. If we maintain a constant voltage while increasing R, the current declines, conversely, decreasing resistance results in an increase in current. <laughs>